Welcome to Toffee TV, it's the instant match reaction. Uh, I can't believe what I've just watched there, what I've just witnessed at Goodison Park. Um, unbelievable, just collapsed by Everton today. I mean, didn't really start, we started out well, but to be fair, listen, number one, Watford wanted that game more than any Everton player on that pitch. Every Watford player ran through a brick wall for their manager and their fans today. And Everton just simply couldn't cope. Um, it was just a, it was just a disgrace. We just got a gang of absolute shitbags playing for us. That's all I can say from today's performance. An absolute gang of shitbags. We scored an early goal, then we conceded from a soft goal uh, from a free kick, which Luca Dean gave away. What's happened to Luca Dean? What has happened to him as a footballer? Jesus Christ! Um, Richarlison, come on, give us that little bit of a spark. Go as our goal, and then, you know. I can't understand what happened after that. The manager for me has made a massive mistake and, and I'll be honest with you, and I'm not saying this, you know, I, I, I think Rafa Benitez is a good manager. I don't, think, I don't think for a lot of people Rafa Benitez will ever come back from this because that's just the way the fans who didn't want him or the fans who were tolerating him just won't, they won't accept him from today onwards. It felt like one of those games. Uh, I can't understand why he brought a wall beyond. But the question's got to be, what the fuck is the point of, of Jean-Philippe Gavannon being on the bench if he's not going to come on in a game like that and grab hold of the midfield? We Listen, they battered us in midfield today. Tom Davis was 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 garbage. Alan was garbage. Once he got the book and he was even more garbage. We needed another man in that midfield today. You've got Jean-Philippe Gavannon sitting on the bench. You've got Holgate sitting on the bench. There's someone who could come in and just mix it up. What is the point of those players if you're not if you're not going to use them what's the point of Gabamon if he can't come on for a game like this in the last 20 minutes then pay up his contract and get rid of him then because there is absolutely no point to him whatsoever no point to him this a movie came on and he's like the case of death isn't he he's like the case of death you've already got Rondon up front running around like I don't know what and how did we fall to bits number one and this is what something I will will blame Benitez from set pieces we are a fucking disgrace and last season we were sound on set pieces and Benitez has ripped it up and gone and put this, you know, this thing he's put in now. And it just doesn't suit our players because they're all shite. They're all shite. None of them want to attack a ball. We've got a team full of cowards. We've got a squad, the thickness of, of paper. And what's the point? What's the point of playing zonal when people don't want to attack the ball? What we had last season worked and he's just got rid of that. But the, the how he collapsed is just beyond me. Yes, they scored a goal. The second goal, sorry for them. What the fuck is Tom Davis doing on the edge of the area? Kicking it away. And I think it, it might have been Alan, I don't know. Someone else had to kick it away. It's led to the ball going in the box and they win a corner and score from a corner. Say to me, they should have scored from another corner later on. And then we just collapsed. What the fuck is going on there at the end? What is going on? They score straight away and then you score two more. Honestly, like, we had nine players playing for us. Like, we'd had two players sent off. 2-1, why didn't we just bring a midfielder on, shore it up in a position where we've been getting destroyed all day, shore the middle of the park up and then see the game out? Or bring Mason Allgate on? Or that today, I'm, I'm, I'll be honest with you, I'm, I'm worried because we've got 14 points and we go into a massively tough spell now. And these players are the fakers. They are, they are fake. They are cowards. None of them have got any heart. Tom Davis is running around, yeah, fair enough. He's running around trying to do things, but it's not leading to anything. The fakes and the hiders and, and, and cowards, and sadly, today is exposed how bad our squad is and how, how little character is in it. You know, players like Luca Dean, who were internationals, Michael Keane, absolute cowards, all of them today. Today, for me, um, I don't, for some people, this will be it for them. Everything, Rafa Benitez won't be able to do anything for now. And all that does is cause upheaval within the football club. And it's a hell of a long week now, isn't it? So we play Wolves, Wolves and Spurs. And we've got no, the spine of the team. You know, Mina showed again how important he is, to, he is today to us. Uh, the Corey, we didn't have a midfield without the Corey today. And obviously Dominic Carvalhoon. So we're in a mess. And I don't know how they're going to sort it out. Because the club is a, just a fucking mess from top to bottom. Apart from the stadium, which, oh, everything will be sound when we get in the stadium. Fucking hell. I don't know where we'll be when we get in the stadium if we play like that. That's absolute disgrace. Anyway, let me know your thoughts. I'm sure you're going to have some very strong thoughts. I'll be doing my player rating soon, which will be interesting. Check out Paz's videos. Thanks for watching. See you later.